Hey guys, welcome to the channel. It's Sarat uh, from Ratku Tarot. And in this whole video, we're going to look into Pisces uh, Sun Moon and also uh, Pisces Rising Weekly General Tarot Reading February 7th up until February 13th, uh, 2022. And uh, should you want to, oh my god, that is such a failed riffle. Uh, anyway, uh, should you want to go forward and skip the draw and uh, move right away to the reading, you can do that by using the timestamps below. Uh, other than this, if you do enjoy the content here on the channel and you do wish to support us, guys, just leave a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you do not miss any of our weekly uploads and as well live streams. All right, so let's uh, check on the draw. Uh, the first card that you do have, Pisces, that is going to be the Four of uh, Wands, followed by the second card of the, that's the Strength card. Moving next, we have uh, the Four of Pentacles. The fifth card for you is going to be the Queen of Cups. And the final card that stands as the King of Cups. Alright, the Family of Cups. But I do want to draw one more card for the Queen of Cups. And the card is going to be... Uh, that's the Knight of Wands, isn't it? Yeah, it's the Knight of Wands. Those uh, couple of cards. Alright, so that's going to do it for the draw. And now let's jump right away to the reading uh, itself. Alright, Pisces, so you can see your uh, spread on the screen. And uh, by the looks of it, we can... Uh, give me a second. Uh, we can separate the week in two phases. We do have a phase one here in between these uh, three cards. And then it is a phase two of these two cards. Now, phase, uh, the both phases are going to be good, especially the first one. Now, the second one, uh, that will come to too much of a kind of like it, it will come up to what what you will decide to make of it okay while the first one is more nar narrative driven and it's uh it's more telegraphed and the first phase is all about you doing uh now uh, can i put it into what uh or you putting the necessary out so you can secure a future for yourself either into your career or either into your relationship and the whole thing starts uh, with uh, the four of uh, with the four of wands and that card uh just give me a moment here to focus a little bit more so with uh, with this card that card first of all it speaks uh, that uh, at this stage let me check on you see well yeah all right so this card here speaks that on this stage at the very start of the week you are going to uh, finish in a very successful way your endeavors especially those endeavors which took a very long time for you to get where you are and it take a lot of efforts i could even classify it as a slog it was really slow and and chaseful experience of your behalf um scoping up the right moments with the right actions and it just it was a lot of a pressure and you can see here at the start of the week that all of them are coming to fruition that's why with that is what that is because the four of uh, wands it's a card showing that you are going to reach a very important cycles of external and internal growth at that particular stage or you can consider it is that the start of the week is going to be you um, tra uh, traversing from one level to another and by the way that is why some consider it as a wedding just because what is wedding if not transcending one level of relationship to another level of relationship but whatever your accomplishments are at uh, this uh, the, at this very early stage of the week which is the start of the week you are going to be very proud about them and even there is going to be an incentive for you to celebrate some uh, specific case about the four of wands it is that you are also with the capability there or incentive there to make some friends as well at work at your social circle or the places you go so if you feel lonely you are you you have the opportunity to be lonely no more but if you think that 
the work is done and you can take a moment for respite you are gravely mistaken because the next card it is at uh, the strength okay and uh, the next level is going to be a bit more demanding than the previous one like for example you end up married here well the marriage is going to be a little bit more demanding than your uh, previous stage of being in a, a boyfriend girlfriend relationship or fiancés right all right uh, as well the next stage of your job or of the project is going to be a little bit more demanding but as well is going to be way more enthusiastic and here the stakes are increasing as well i mean the reward is going to be far greater than the reward you are to accept here finalizing the cycle of growth with uh, the uh with the four of ones at the very start of the week however with the strength card uh, there will be that how do I put it into words? Um, conviction. You are going to become convinced in your ways. What I mean is that once you do uh, make that stepping stone with the four of wands, you will have your own uh, conviction that there is a certain way how you should proceed forward okay and probably you are also going to be entrusted with it okay your boss tells you 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 prove yourself enough do whatever you think is right okay i i fully trust you but uh with the strength card from the mid towards the end of the week that card shows that you will you will have no need and no reason whatsoever to explain why you want to do something or, or why you are acting in a such way you know or why in generally you have such a goal it's just people are going to trust you uh on a slightly negative note the 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 process here is going to take a little bit more patience than the previous one so you can expect things to slow down a little bit after you finalize your uh, your stuff for example you do finalize your negotiations the projects of these negotiations it's really enthusiastic really interesting you see the prospects there but it takes slowly it takes a little bit slower than you have expected and here you will have to kind of like persevere through patience with the strength card but alas towards the middle of the week the week things are gonna start coming into fruition with uh, the four of pentacles because at that moment at the middle of the week you are to see that you have ensured the succession of that next level as well so it seems that very very quickly you are going to make a name of yourself and as well you are to you are to prove that you have been the right choice the right person for the job the right match for the relationship or whatever it is that you are after here and uh, with the four of pentacles as well not just only you are to ensure it's it's future whatever enterprise that is about but also you are to take the necessary defensive actions or standby readiness um to to protect it not to jeopardize it or not allow anybody to jeopardize it whatsoever so that that first half of the week for you pisces it's a it's an, an experience or a follow-up or an, an unfoldment where you are to consolidate strength strengthen and define a domain a big domain something that is going to make you feel very comfortable and is going to make you feel as well very wealthy not necessarily only about money as well and uh once you do secure that thing then you will have some time on your on your hand or that is what you will think until that individual queen of uh, cups <clears throat> with the knight of wands shows up into your environment so these are very difficult people and they are difficult people because they are very insecure i mean they these two cards form a bond of a passive enemies and that person it's just they 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 don't know what to do they don't know what to do by themselves they always have to be told of what uh, 
uh, what is the goal, right? Or how the goal should be reached. It is just their hand needs to be constantly guided. I don't know exactly what manifestation they will have for you. Uh, what I can tell you it is that they make off a very good friend, but also it doesn't look like that. Uh, how can I put it into words? Uh, it doesn't look like that they can contribute materially. It is just if you do need help, that's not the person you go for help, really, because uh, as soon as they see something difficult, or some kind of a difficulty they just panic they don't know what to do they don't know how to how to react on it god forbid that is somebody that it will you are going to show interest into it is because you have to be very careful what you say extremely touchy individual very emotional as well but again they don't know how to react on these emotions and you say something that they d does not interpret the right way that could inflict um Depression, it could inflict as well closure in the sense where they close themselves and they don't speak anymore and it's kind of like they are crying all night for it. It's a, but, uh, but, but you haven't meant anything bad, anything malicious here. So you have to thread very, very careful with this person how you're going to recognize them. Well, there are people who are more or less kind of settled for what they have they don't have any particular ambition they don't have any particular expectations it's just they go along with as life is okay and also they are rather quiet in public uh, if you happen to meet them at the bar they are going to be you know in the corner there just drinking their beverage not making contact with everybody usually they do answer straight away in the sense of you ask them something they don't give much of an explanation they say yes or no and so on and so forth can something uh, business wise happen in between you two mm not advisable at all these these are terrible business dealers can something emotional happen in between you two yes definitely but again you will have to take the full initiative there if you do want to make things to happen whatever the case is with the king of cups at the end i do believe that there is going to be somewhat of an incentive for a future for in between you two for you both are going to see but you have something in common to share and that you do feel for one another to a certain extent that could be with the king of cups also the moment where they are divulging their emotions towards you which doesn't have to be love as well okay it's just they tell you that they feel that they know you for a very very long time but in order that to happen it's it's gonna happen in a place or in a time where you're just two of you okay they they have they are ashamed of what they feel it's just such a strange individual once once again but with the king of cups um i think that and for the lack of a better word a deal is to be struck a deal in a sense of how they can be a part of your life how big part it is you to decide if you do decide that you do want to have a a thing with them at all and that's why i said at the start of the reading that that will play out depending on what you will decide okay um and that deal is going to be mutual uh, with a mutual benefit because uh, it's just with the king of cups Things does not happen in a way that only one benefits from. I don't know how to explain it here. Well, I can, but it's going to take a lot of time, uh, and that's not the purpose of the, of this reading as well. And uh, that's uh, that's pretty much how the the week wraps up at the end, where you do have that person, which you may feel connected with in the same way, even pity for in a say in a certain way, and you may not know what to do of them at all at that point you, do, you may not know how that person really fits with your uh with your life at this given moment but i would advise you here pisces just focus on the start of the week do what you are striving for put a good work behind it because 
the rewards are there guys the follow-up looks very good as well where there are going to be even more enthusiastic uh experiences and enterprises as a rewards to you and you are gonna do strive to do a really good job into them very very quickly as well ensuring their succession so with that being said that was your uh, weekly general tarot reading pisces hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it guys and uh, we are to see each other next time until then Bye.